Hey guys, so this is going to be a hair review. Um, as you guys can see, this is some straight hair, right? Would you believe that this is the same hair that I had for eight months? Well, actually now it's hitting nine months. I've had this hair. Um, this is the Ali Perfect Hair Products. Um, it is the Brazilian Kinky Curly 24 inches. Um, I'll have all the specifications down below about um, where I got the hair from, like the links and everything. Um, you guys, like, this is crazy. I need to tell you guys a story because I feel like if I can't tell you guys a story, then you won't understand why I'm so shocked that I still, like, this hair is still, like, living. I just, I don't know. So, so after I already did the one month review for, um, for the hair at the time, it was, like, around, like, September time. I was telling you guys that the hair was hard to maintain, but it was just, I really liked the curls. I was getting really tired of the curls, so I decided to perm the hair like literally like a week after that video and it relaxed the curls like the curls turned out to be like you know like loose wave but it didn't really get rid of like the matting like I had matting in the back so I was just like okay what am I gonna do with this hair like I'm putting way too much like way too much things into this hair I put like I permed it I, I bought all these different like products like, I was wasting so much money so I was just like I gotta cut it out like I gotta take it out so I took it out and I literally just like dumped it underneath my bed and never touched it again. Then like spring break came and that was like, you know, around like March time. And I was like, okay, I need to figure out what hair I'm going to wear for like the remainder of spring semester. Like I don't want to go and buy a new weave and I didn't want to go and buy like synthetic hair, which would be cheaper. But I just, I was just like, I don't really want that. I want some type of hair that I can be curling because it's going to be like, you know, springtime. I want to be able to curl my hair, get some nice cute waves. Like, you know what I mean? So I was just like, okay, what am I going to do? So then I was like, maybe I should try to revive, like, this hair. And this hair was, like, dead, you guys. Like, it was disgusting. So <clears throat> I watched some videos on YouTube, and a lot of people were like, oh, you know, use um, silicone mix. Like, silicone mix is awesome to, um, you know, repair your virgin hair and also, like, you know, your actual hair. So I was like, oh, then I need to get this. But the thing that I did not really check on was that there's different types of silicone mix. There's like the fortifying one and then the dry and brittle one and then there's some other one. But the one that everyone was raving about was the dry and brittle one, but I accidentally got the um fortifying one. So the fortifying one actually did work a little bit but I felt like if but I feel like if I got the um the dry and brittle one it probably would have, you know, worked out so much better. But I literally just like washed the hair with some regular like shampoo that I had, <coughs> moisturizing shampoo. Then I just slabbered on like the silicone mix all over the hair and then I tried to comb it but you know I couldn't really comb it because it was like matted so I just like let it soak inside like the hair, put it inside a shot prep bag, tied it and then left it in my room for like you know almost like a whole entire day and then like the next day I rinsed it out, combed, combed out all of the the tangles and there was like it was like easier for me to comb like I was actually able to comb out the tangles like before I couldn't comb out the tangles so I was just like okay like this is better like I'm happy so then I installed it and this time I installed it with a little bit more hair out um I'm not sure you guys can see but I left out like about like this much hair out and um I just I really like it this way I like a little bit more hair out so then I can actually like do more styles like I can like pull my hair back like you know one side back I can do like you know you know that style where people like you know put the little bun on top of their head like yeah I'm able to do that too um so I just I just like this because I feel like lace fronts are just like easier for you to like you know style and also like I sewed it on so I feel like when it's sewed on and you have like some hair out in the front like I feel like it just it looks a lot more like realistic and then it's more versatile and it's cheaper to install like I it took um the lady only charged me like $50 to install it but usually when I do so and she charges me like about like 200 bucks so I was just like okay like I'm thinking of making sure I do like lace fronts or I buy lace fronts because I just feel like it's easier you know so 
yeah so then after that um yeah i installed it and i was just loving the hair this these are some pictures of how the hair looked um after like i installed it i was in love with it it was pretty chill like i loved it and then um so i've had this hair installed for a month so far um i'm loving it it's just like it's awesome um <clears throat> The only thing that I can say that I'm not really liking about the hair is that it sheds a lot. But I just feel like like I get the shedding and I get um, some matting in the back and, you know, like snags as I run my fingers through. But I just feel like after everything like I've been through with this hair before when it was like curly and then when it was like, you know, like permed, like I just feel like <laughs> I feel like, like this doesn't bother me because I like it, it was like. I just feel like that was just so much work I put into the hair that like now that the hair looks like this like you know I, I don't even care like, that it sheds I don't care that like it tangles but obviously like when I get like you know some new hair I'm <laughs> I don't think I'm buying this again but it's just it's awesome that this hair lasted for so long and then it's still looking thick it's still looking like you know really really pretty like I just I love it. So these are the products that I use um, for conditioner. I use the Herbal Essence Hello Hydration. I love this product. Um, it really like makes this hair super silky. Um, like sometimes I would do like a co-wash with it. Like I did a co-wash with it um, yesterday and then I just let it air dry and then I straightened out my hair. And then um, and then shampoo, I use the Herbal Essence Moroccan My Shine. This is a nourishing um, shampoo. It smells so good. Oh, I need to get the conditioner for this one, but I already have like this big, huge container of conditioner, so I don't think that's happening anytime soon. And then um, heat protecting, I use the Tresemme Thermal uh, Creations Heat Tamer Leave-In Spray. It's this little thing. You, you guys see everyone use this. This works pretty well. And then... Um, you know, my baby. I love my baby. The Garnier Fruity Sleek and Shine Anti Frizz Serum. I love this. I love this. I love this. This is life. Like, if your guys' hair gets poofy, get this because this is uh, it's just it's perfect. It's perfect. So I love this. Um, and yeah, and then for my hair, like my actual hair, um, braided underneath in a container like this. Um, I don't actually use whatever that was in here. I used to use it, but I didn't really like it. But yeah, I poured it out, and then I put some water, and then I put um, Proclaim Professional Care Natural 7 Oil. I put um, a few drops of this, and then I put Equate Beauty um, Astringent. I use this. And this is pretty much what like cleans like my hair because I don't wash my hair. I know you're like, girl, like what? I'm like, I know, like, <laughs> but this like helps like you know keep my hair clean. And then I know some people are gonna be like, that's really weird, but like it honestly does. Like I've been doing this for like a year and a half. It's been helping a lot. And I feel like before I used to just you know try to wash my hair and then put like you know. Um, oil and stuff but I feel like that just like it it causes a lot of like build up um, and also like it causes a lot of matting so you, you just have more breakage well for me so I decided that I wanted something that's going to clean my hair while I put it in while also like you know putting oil inside and this astringent, this astringent has been with me forever so if you guys need something to be cleaning up your hair make sure your scalp does not smell <laughs> everything this is for you so yeah so I mix everything up and then you know just kind of like inside my tracks so I like that stuff and my hair doesn't itch when I use that too so you guys should get it definitely get it astringents I know you're supposed to use it on your face but I use it <laughs> I use it on my scalp so that's pretty much it you guys so i hope you guys like the video and you guys have an awesome and blessed day i love you guys bye